All right, folks, check it out. We're, all right, today, in today's video, first of all, check out the hat. Now, I made these hats, obviously, for myself. It's got a picture of my blazer on it. Um, however, I did make extra in case anyone wants to purchase one. They are $25. If you pick it up, $30 if I ship it. Now, I'm on my way because I've got a hat here for my mechanic. But we're going to take the two-wheel drive. i got to pump up some tires here first. Um, but here's the thing. After we go drop this hat off, <clears throat> We're gonna take this truck up of a little place called Willow Creek. Now Willow Creek is where I usually take the Jeep and the Suburban and stuff like that. But I get a little, I get a lot of comments from people who say, you know, we used to take our two wheel drives and we used to go everywhere and blah, 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 right? <clears throat> so, you know what we're doing? We're gonna take this bad boy and we're gonna see how far up Willow Creek we can go in two wheel drive. Now. I've took the Suburban all the way to the top. I don't know if there's snow, I don't know if there's mud, I don't know what's up there. But we're gonna go find out, so stay tuned. All right, folks, check it out. We're in the square body, the farm truck. I call this one the farm truck. I don't think it was really used on a farm. It's not, it's not a farm truck now, I just, I just call it the farm truck. But. Just dropped the hat off at my mechanic. It was idling a little bit and I had my fuel pump on. I think it might have been getting too much fuel. It was, we were there talking for a little while and then it just kind of, I, I went to go show him the motor and it just, just died. So I kept getting slowly and slowly. But anyways, it died on me. So I got it started. Uh, I started driving it and it felt like something was wrong. Like my, uh, it was like when I let off the gas, it was like really catching me. So I think my emergency brake was stuck. It's a really good emergency brake. It really, you know, it'll it'll stop it. But I don't think it was fully stuck. So I drove it around a little bit and I kept giving it the gas, letting it off. Anyways, I came to a stop sign and then it just like it started working again. So, I was just heading home. I was gonna maybe just go check some stuff out because I was like, well shit, I don't want this thing to... I didn't know what was wrong with it, but it's driving fine now. It's raining. So, we're gonna go up Willow Creek and we're gonna see if it's raining or snowing. I don't know if I'll be able to get very far because it's obviously, uh, it's just a dual drive truck. So, uh, we're gonna go have some fun regardless, so stay tuned. All right, folks, we are about to hit the dirt road. So, anyways, we're just out having fun, right? So, so check it out. So, I actually, we actually took work off today because, well, it was supposed to rain. Now, I don't know if it's raining where we're supposed to be working. But it came in a little later than the news was saying it was going to. So, I'm kind of bummed. I could have still went out and got maybe four, five, six hours worth of work in. Uh, maybe five. I don't know. But, it is what it is. I made a call. We were going to be working on some sprinklers today. And I don't really want to work on sprinklers in the rain anyways. So, it's supposed to be colder. So, anyways, it is what it is. Here we are. So, now, we're just in the two-wheel drive square body so it's raining we're in first gear we still got our low gear low gear is not really gonna do anything in mud though you spin those wheels but I'm just gonna film and we'll just see how far we can get in this bad boy I'm trying to keep an eye on my temperatures and shit all right folks I don't know how this mount's gonna do but there we go Well, 
that ain't gonna work. So we'll have to figure, we'll have to figure something else out. Actually, okay, I think I got this. All right, there we go. That's a little better. I think that'll stay on this visor here a lot better. So hopefully this, hopefully this stabilization mode works pretty good. If not, I'll definitely be putting it in uh, fast mode. kind of back into right here
do you think? I think I think we're gonna try. I think we're gonna try a second second to third gear pull up around that corner. If I can get her, keep her on. Come on. Defoster works. That's kind of nice. It's working slow, but we'll kick it on high. There we go. Alright, we're gonna give her one more go. Second and the third. Well, maybe next time, this two-wheel drive ain't getting up here. Not around this corner right here. So, it's raining, it's slick. I got ball tires. So, I take that back. Maybe if I had a set of decent tires, I might be able to make it up this. So, maybe I'll go talk to Steve. Maybe I'll get some decent tires put on this thing one of these days. But check out. There's that hat again. Whew, she's popping up here. Anyways, that's it. I'm gonna go because it's raining. I'm getting wet. Uh we just need a little bit more oomph right here. Actually, if this thing was locked up, if that rear end was locked up, I could probably make it. But you'd be surprised at where you can go with a rear end that's locked up. But I'm getting stuck on this side because obviously it's like snow and uh that tire just wants to spin so anyways peace out y'all have a good day smile smile every freaking morning you get to wake up because you're alive absolutely wonderful to be alive and be able to do shit like this if you can't do stuff like this make doing more fun things a priority recharge every now and then if you're stuck in a job you hate just get out and do life look at that it's kind of snowing up here anyways all right peace out ah, peep peep the hat folks <laughs> richardson 112. so we're just Lally gagging down the mountain in uh, low granny gear and uh, I definitely feel like I should put a manual transmission in the Suburban or the Blazer. I don't know what to do. That's my heater by the way. It's a Blaren. Full blast. It works. It's actually blowing hot air. Wow. Look at that. Anyways, yeah, we're up here in the two-wheel drive. We made it quite a bit, actually. Uh, obviously, you've seen in the video, we couldn't go any further, but thank you for everybody who supports me. Uh, these hats, honestly, if you want some, great. I'll sell them. If not, man, I'll just have a lot of hats to wear for this YouTube video, which is fine because, you know what? They're cheap hats for myself as far as, you know, making them. Obviously, I'm going to make a little profit off of selling them. But for those who want to support the channel, all you got to do is just watch, just watch, like, don't ever feel obligated to buy something, but if you do, it helps the channel, it helps me be able to go film more, uh, put some of this money into building the Blazer, next up is the crew cab, everything I'm putting money into building these vehicles and having fun and breaking stuff for the channel, uh, it's all just money. So any little bit helps just liking and sharing the videos and, and interacting with the stuff on facebook helps out so 
thank you very much to everybody who supports the channel and those who don't i yeah awesome thank you even the haters make me money so have a nice day everybody i've seen a lot of change been through a lot of pain some things are not the same as they were a year ago But all will be okay I move on each and every day The past is where it stays Wait 